Continuing our coverage of two deaths in Liberty today, where a man and a woman were found dead in a home on Murray Hill Drive. Police haven't shared many details with us, but First News reporter Desiree Gosselin spoke with neighbors at the scene. She joins us now with what we know so far. Des. Samantha, police really haven't released that many details to us, but we do know that a family member is the one who notified police, and that is what sparked this investigation. I did talk to one woman, though, and she's been living on Murray Hill Road for since about 2015, she told me, and she said it's absolutely shocking that something like this would happen in her neighborhood. This is the first time since I've lived here that we've had a homicide on our road. Obviously, we know homicides happen everywhere, but to have it happen this close to home. Amber Gallagher Schranz lives directly across the street from the home where two bodies were discovered Saturday. Like, we're all like, what? How could this happen? Like, this is Murray Hill Drive. This is probably one of the safest streets <laughs> you could live on in Liberty. Amber says she knows just about everyone who lives on this block, and this is the kind of place where neighbors will watch one another's houses when they go on vacation. So to have it happen on such a, a main route in Liberty that everybody knows, that everybody frequents, that the students are constantly walking up and down the street, like we have high traffic volumes up the street during school season, this is a big shock. I did reach, reach out to Liberty Chief of Police Toby Malaro earlier today to ask if they suspect foul play or if police are investigating this incident as a homicide. He told me that he is waiting for the coroner's ruling to come back before he can say. Reporting live in the studio, Desiree Gosselin, WKBN 27 First News.